What's going on, everybody? Thanks for tuning back in here to another episode here on the Speedbug channel. Well, another update. It's been a while. This is going to be a brief video, but uh, it's going to be getting the car back and then doing some other things. I didn't really film part of all of it going into paint and stuff, but I do have some pictures and stuff that I will include here in the video uh, so that you all can see that. But uh, I did also film the interior going back together and some of the body panels, but uh, here it is. So now, as you can see that the car is painted, the car hasn't been buffed, but the paint is on. Uh, I forget the exact black. I think it's a Mercedes black, but I'm not 100% sure. But all the interior and stuff now is back in. Everything's been painted. Door jams, everything. Sail panel, all done. Now it's been sitting in here for about two weeks because I haven't been able to, uh, you know, kind of finish and do everything. But, uh, yeah, so hatch is, hatch is being painted, all the uh, rockers and the mirrors, the, the little pieces that go here, everything's been done. The car has not been wet sanded and buffed yet. We're still letting some of the paint in the clear coat cure. It's got three coats of base and five coats of clear. Now, for the ones that are saying, oh, that's so much clear, remember, I want to be able to sand it down and knock it down and get it super flat. And as you can see, you all know that this is a plastic and fiberglass car, except for the rear quarters. It's, uh, it's pretty damn straight. So wanted to give an update on that. Uh, everything else is coming along flawlessly. I did order a big brake kit, and I got the calipers and stuff in. And uh, the rotors and stuff are over there, and they came in silver. So that's why I'm painting, as you can see, the red ones. So I want them to be red and no longer silver, but everything has come along very nicely. See all the door jams, everything's painted, everything's perfect. So keep coming along and uh, we'll finish the rest of it. But I wanted to give everyone a update because people were wondering kind of about this and uh, it's still going along strong. So got some wiring to finish up here in the front lights, clean up some things like that. You know, I don't like this, uh, you know, looking kind of like I don't know. It's just dingy. It's just, you know, it's 20 something years old. So we'll cover that up with some uh, flat back spray paint and uh, call it a day. There you go. Don't look bad. All right, little update here. Got all the brake lines, brake, bled, ABS, all bled. Kit back on the car. For ones that are wondering, this is C5 Z06 brakes that were a bolt-on in application. So I was able to get that on. So now you guys can see all that. And it worked perfectly fine with my Mosier rear end. I have a nine inch in here. You can see that here. We just wanted to give a quick update on that. And just waiting for the rest of the parts to be painted. Cleaned up some wiring for the uh, headlights up front. Just got to do a couple extra little paintings and stuff here. And get all that cleaned up. And we'll be bolting on some, uh, some more parts here onto the car. Hopefully here soon. But uh, that's the next update here. And then we'll get the rest of the parts bolted on. Everything else to cure. Get the mirrors, hood, little pieces for, on the sail panel, uh, deck lid, whale tail the works you know the rest and uh, we'll get all that bolted on and uh, the car will be put, to, uh, put back together we'll get it wet sanded and uh, polished out and then we're definitely obviously since the uh, clear coat and everything I want this car to stay protected because I plan on keeping this car for a long time or maybe forever especially with everything I've put into it now that it's getting older it's getting a classic so we'll go ahead and uh, keep that and uh, we're definitely going to get this thing clear broad uh, expel at least the front half but uh, potentially maybe the entire car but definitely the front half like the impact parts the bumper believe it or not the hood actually doesn't get that impacted but if we can do it we will do it depending on how crappy it looks and the mirrors and of course the fender so the bumper the hood the fenders and maybe the rear bumper because it likes to kick and spit rocks and shit so 
we'll do that and uh, there's your update and we will uh, see you for another episode here on the speedbug channel peace